You can see all of these piles of horse manure. Well, lack thereof, because I've been picking them up. I've been uh, loading them up into this big bag because it's clean horse manure with no seeds or anything and easy to pick up. And uh, I'm scooping it up with that fork there, putting it in the black bin and then putting it in the big white bag to bring to the garden. Thing is, here, right next to each other, is one, two, three different ages of horse manure. That one being the oldest. So, I was gonna see what, um, oh, are you helping? No, you're not, good. Um, what dung beetle activity there is. In the oldest, there's very little, hardly, there's no animals in it whatsoever, except for a puppy who's wandering through. So that's the oldest one. Then there's this one, which is the next age and stage. And again, it's really dry. You can see the pock markness. See that, that's the dung beetle activity. So these are all gonna go in there. There's next to no activity or rather the absence of dung beetles just because they've all uh, departed. So this is the most recent pile of um, horse dung in amongst the daisies. Now let's see what the dung beetle activity is like under here. Still old enough that the dung beetle activity has already happened. You can see those holes there and it's really light because they've taken out most of the moisture of it. So there is again, no dung beetle activity. But you can see this kind of had the formation of manure and the older it got, the more dusty it became. Like this just disintegrates like that. This is excellent stuff for the garden, by the way. Um, it's excellent organic matter, even though the dung beetles have taken a lot of stuff out of it. It's really, really good. Yes, you are hot. But this is the freshest uh, of these three. And the dung beetles have already been there. They've come and gone. So there's no dung beetle activity, no active dung beetle activity at the moment. So that bin is full. Let me see if I can find a, a horse manure that um, is even fresher that might have some activity. So you can see loads of um, dung beetles. Ah, there's one right there. That looks like it might be a recent enough one that there might be dung beetle activity in this one. So let's see. Up oh, there is, there's dung beetles. Okay, so there you can see that wonderful copper one there. That's uh, a dung beetle right there. I don't know if you can see. So there's one species. Let's see, is there any others? There's other ones, they're all climbing. They're all burying themselves thinking I'm a bird about to eat them. So this is, but this is already getting light uh, from the dung beetles already eating and digesting a lot of it a lot of the manure. So that is what I'm doing, is collecting this stuff, which is excellent for plants and roses. Oh, look, my gloves torn. Um, so that's uh, delicious stuff for the garden, as well as delicious stuff for the field, as well as dogs find it very delicious. So isn't that right, pups? Yeah, they find it very delicious as well. <laughs>